Hello everyone, welcome to another DOS short. Uh, this one is going to be about the differences between copy and xcopy and kind of their application. So let's just get into it. So the copy command is going to copy one or more files to another location. Um, but another cool thing it can do uh, is uh, concatenate files. So if you want to copy uh, two files into one file, you can also do that. So let's make a file here. So Instead of just using the editor, I'm going to use the copy command to make a copy or make a file. So you can copy console into, let's call this file one. Okay, yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, overwrite the one I already had there. So um, now I'm gonna enter the contents I want to go into file one. So this is file one. All right, so it's gonna have that line. And to get out of this, you're going to control Z, sorry. Okay, so now we have file one sitting down there. So what I can do is let's make a directory and call it uh, copy test. All right, now we'll copy file one to copy test. All right, so if we do a directory in there, there's our file one. All right, so let's make another file and uh, we'll just do it like this. We'll copy file one to file two. So now we have two files there. They both say the same thing and you can see they're the same size and everything. So if we wanna bring those into one file so we could actually just use copy file one plus file two, and we want our output file to be file three, that's fine. So now we have directory and let's look at file three. See, we have uh, this is file one, this is file one. That's the output of both of those. So all text out of there. And that's all I'm going to do on a copy command. So the X copy command uh, copies files, uh, except for hidden or system files. And it'll also do uh, directories and subdirectories as well. So let's take a look and see what we can do about uh, copying directories and subdirectories. A lot of times you're going to use X copy if you're like you're copying a disk to your hard drive or something like that, because you want to include the whole thing. Make another directory called X copy test. And let's just pick something to to copy in there. So, uh, devel, and we'll we'll go ahead and copy QBasic into there. And actually, we're gonna want to specify slash e for this. So, you see how it copied the entire uh, tree into there. So there's X copy tests and it copied everything into there. That's pretty much all I wanted to go over there. Uh, if you want to delete uh, that structure, you can do del tree. That's a delete a tree. So we'll do delete tree. Yes, go ahead and delete that. There is nothing in there. All right. Well, thank you for watching and have a good day.